Why hello there, and welcome to another Makeup Edible video. Today I'm gonna to be attempting to turn myself into Winifred. We're gonna get our Sanderson sister on. I just wanna say something real quick before we even begin. I ate this, and it wouldn't let me do the video. This is some good stuff right here. <laughs> I don't know what you guys did with this brownie. I'm all right with 100 milligrams. I could normally get through it, but something about this brownie did me in last time. I need help. I don't think I have to tell you the obvious, but I bit off way more than I could chew on that last one. Oh, too big of a bite again. <laughs> All right, witches. This is the last bite. Cheers. It's down the hatch. I'm gonna go wash up, okay? And now we wait. Amy and Al, if you're watching, I don't know what the heck you're doing, but keep doing it, don't stop. Oh, oh, I thought that was a beauty blender, but it's not. I will be covering my eyebrows. So we got our glue stick here, and I actually, this time, actually, I actually, actually, I do actually have, how many times did I just say actually? I have something to brush my eyes up this time. Go against the grain, against the grain. You're gonna brush up. I haven't seen the new movie. I did see a lot of people complaining on Facebook. <laughs> that looks amazing. I mean, what else am I gonna do with this? What is this even for? I don't know. But I'm never gonna put liquid on him. Only powder, okay? Really? Derma blend. Makeup for your body. Flawless victory. Thank you for your assistance. The lip situation. We're taking the red part right here. For this over-exaggeration idea that I have, I'm going to be using this latex. And we're also going to be using some toilet paper. I always use the latex as the, I always use my, I always use the bowl. Hello? I'm gonna take another little squeegee. Actually, no, it's the same one I was just using. That's good. We don't want to just keep blowing through squeegees, do we? I'm gonna be tripping the, tripping the toilet paper. I'm gonna make it like a little bow tie pasta, okay? We've all been there. My idea is to try to make the top lip. I'm gonna rip. There's my top lip. Now I'm gonna take some latex. I'm going to put it on the top lip. Now let's do the bottom one. Repeating the same step, putting some latex on the back. Time for costume. Ooh, oh, 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 I'm getting there. Let's go ahead and put this. <laughs> I did not have to. This is so cool, oh my gosh. Oops, still wet. <laughs> wet paint, don't touch. It is actually for Hocus Pocus. I paid full price. $9.97 at Walmart. Pippi Longstocking is coming into your town. Now, let's move on to eyebrows. She does have eyebrows. I know it doesn't look like it, but she does. I think, I don't know. Maybe I should look at a reference photo. I'm gonna be taking this orange palette right here. I'm gonna be going with this color. Did they go too high? Too close together? Nah. Okay, I just looked at a photo for reference and these eyebrows aren't... Nobody was doing this. I was trying to throw something on the wall to make it stick and it's sliding down. Blush, I'm gonna be taking my Malibu Barbie. This color, Best Coast. Uh, ooh la la. 
Thank you, placement is perfect. You don't have to tell me twice. I will be taking some paint and that's what I'm gonna be painting over these lips. Hey, I'm kind of doing the queen from Alice in Wonderland. I got this to use as eyeshadow primer. I just put a little on my finger. Now this is in porcelain. I'm gonna take some powder. And now this lid has been primed for eyeshadowing. <laughs> That's not the right term, but you get it. I forgot how itchy this dress is. Now, it looks to be that she has eyeliner. I love this palette so much. Do you guys know this palette? This is such a good palette. I'm gonna be taking this one in the color Chad. If you can see it, it says Chad. <laughs> Jeez Louise, stop itching my armpit, you bastard. So I'm gonna use this brush because it's the one that looks like it'll work the best. Next, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be doing eyeshadow. She has dark eyeshadow. So we're gonna be going in with Chad. And because I put this down, you know, the primer stuff, I should uh, be able to smooth this around Pretty good. Oh. <laughs> we're gonna go on the other side of the Chad. Hey, cat brother. Next, we're moving on to lashes. Check this out. We're gonna be trying a new product. New product alert, new product alert. Give your lashes a dramatic and sensuous look with a soft and conditioned feel. Bold, huh? I've been known to become bold. Smell it. I love smelling mascara, dude. Not a good first impression, I'm gonna be honest with you. Maybe we need to let it breathe. That's getting better, it's getting better. Let's get close up there, come here. Okay, this is some nice stuff. You guys, the dollar store ain't the dollar store anymore. I went there the other day and everything says from the 99 cent store but with like a $5.99 price tag on it. Next, I'm gonna put these things on. Ooh, fun. We're almost there. Ooh. That's your sneak peek what it's gonna, what, what everything is gonna look like. <sighs> latex has been applied to one. Latex has been applied to two. Lego. Lego. Just Lego. Oh! Found this at the thrift store. Yes, queen. What's going on though? Hold on. <laughs> Is this like the top? Oh yeah, that's a hood. What's wrong with it? There you go. <laughs> It's because my hair is crazy. I'm gonna do something that I, I don't I don't know if this is a good idea or not, okay? I'm gonna actually glue nails onto my nails. The aftermath, I'm gonna be doing something and I thought it would make it more challenging. Let's go ahead and nail it up. What I have is this. When I'm done, I'm just gonna clip them and then you just soak your fingers, right? How'd I do, dudes? Whoa, what? Sanderson scissors. I actually used to do nails. I never worked in a shop. It was always out of my house. I loved it. And I used to wear nails myself, but truthfully, it's irritating when you're not listened to when you're getting your nails done. I got just so upset about that. I dropped my nail I was just holding on to. Did you see that? I finally gave up. I'm like, you know what? I'm done with this. Never felt more liberated and free. One time she glued my pinky weird. It was crooked. It was completely crooked. And I was getting a brand new set and everybody that gets their nails done knows what I'm talking about. When you're getting a brand new set and you got your acrylics off, you want those puppies glued on correctly because you're gonna be with them for a little bit. <laughs> she glued on my pinky crooked and I'm having a panic attack. I'm like, oh my God, no. <gasps> so, and I said, excuse me, um, that's a little crooked. She said, oh no, no, no. I said, yes it is. And she goes, well, I'll file it when, when we're done. All right, fine, I'll let it slide, okay? I'll let it slide, all right? I'll let it slide. But I don't wanna let it slide. I just don't know how to use my voice. I just don't wanna hurt anybody's feelings. And she's filing and she's filing it the crooked way. She had the audacity to tell me that 
My finger is just shaped that way. No, it's not. No, it's not. No, it's not. I won't accept it. And I'm gonna put a spell on you and you won't be mine. Just keep the change. I need to get outside before Niagara Falls starts coming in my, my eyeballs. I'm never coming back again. I was tired of getting my nails done, so I just taught myself how to do it. So anyway, that's the story of, of, my, of my experience with nails. I enjoyed them. I always had them very short. These are very, very long. Pinkies on. Pointer? Pointer? No! That's what she did to me! That's what she did to me! That's not the shape of my finger! Ah! Oh. Okay, I'm just gonna try to put glue on every single one of my nails just really, really quick, and then I'm just gonna go for it. One. Come on, come on, come on, come on. It's very hard, they're so long. One, two, three, four, five, six. Pinky. Oh. Maybe my, maybe my pinky is a little crooked. I've done it. Oh, book! Book! Where is that book? Oh, got it. Hello, book, how are you? Oh, I've missed you so much. We're gonna need a cauldron. Here we go. This spell is going to be for everybody who goes and gets their nails done. For you never to have a bad experience again after you've spent your heart on pinties. What do we need, book? First, we need a feather from a yellow bird. Wow, you guys are really lucky. I literally have that. Oh geez, oh no. I need some magical glitter dust. I know what you're thinking, super easy to get, you're a witch. No, it's not super easy to get. This glitter dust is supposed to be from a lizard's booty. It's not like a fairy dust type situation. Oh, whoa, that's crazy, right there. What? Perfect. From now on, when they spend money, you must listen to them, honey. Okay, so the point of this was to have some smoke and a cool, like, you know, reaction, but right now, we're just having fire in the bucket. As you can see, it's getting a little bit bigger. Oh, it's getting actually bigger than I expected. Well, that's weird. That's not even that big of a piece of paper. Oh! Oh. Oh, geez. Not to worry, everybody. Help! 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 Why did it get bigger when I did that? <coughs> okay, that got dangerous. Now it's time to get Dan in here to see what he thinks. Oh man, when he sees that party, he's gonna be like, I told you no fire in the house. <laughs> It'll never happen again. I just told Dan to come in and I forgot about my teeth. There you go. Focus, focus. Looks just like her. Pretty good, right? Pretty <laughs> good, <laughs> You look good. I do? Mm -hmm. Thanks so much. Good job, baby. Thanks, babe. I appreciate it. I love each and every single one of you with all of my soul. Now, it is time for me to dance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I hurt my neck on that one.